a chance to get up close and personal with a real-life monster, and a moment to think about the long history of life on our planet. That's what this display, Life at the Edge, at the UBC Pacific Museum of Earth, is for. So we wanted to use dinosaurs as kind of like a hook to get people thinking about some of the bigger questions that we're talking about in this department, like the effects of climate change, like deep time. The big dinosaur is Depletosaurus taurosus, an older relative of the infamous T-Rex. Depletosaurus lived in what is now Alberta around 70 million years ago. Rod Bartlett is in charge of putting it together. This is all cast. Uh, and it's based on probably 25 to 30% of actual skeleton. So you get different bits. You tend to get the larger bones preserved. Sometimes you don't get the smaller bones preserved. Now, when you think big animals, you might think a moose or a buffalo or a grizzly bear or a polar bear, but none of them have anything on this prehistoric monster. The scene is set 76 million years ago on the edge of the Cretaceous Paleogene mass extinction when a devastating meteor wiped out three quarters of the species on Earth. Some kids got a sneak peek at the display today, and one eighth grader was lucky enough to get a view behind the glass. It's a very cool display piece, and you realize just like how complicated it is, and um, you know, like how much work we've actually put into it, and what it's actually like. And you get to get a much better view of it. It gives you quite a sense of wonder. This isn't his first time up close and personal with a fossil. That up, he found one of his own on a recent vacation. I found a crocodile, a crocodile fossil, so, uh, and I brought that home with me from all the way from France. The exhibit it officially opens to the public July 2nd in Vancouver, Jack Morse, City News.